and that was for me. And before, like I had, had, I had the day that I was going to Gremlin, and I knew a day I was going, and I was excited. Like for me, I feel like this is gonna be for me. Like I was already knowing that this is gonna be right, for me. Right, right. So right. yeah, it felt right. So when I got out there, it was exactly what I thought it was gonna be. Yeah. And then all the coaches show love. Like it, it was a good environment. Yeah. Teammates, everything yeah. was good. So, I'm going to start off, I know last time I talked about how I started music. Um, right now I go to Long Beach Poly High School. Uh, that's kind of like where everything started for me as far as music go. Um, yeah, like I met my boy Jason. He kind of like, he was already doing music when I got to high school. I knew I, knew I could rap, but I never made a song before. Like, the structure of it. Yeah, it like, it no, I take that back. I, I I had made a song with my dad before, but I had never made, like, a song where it's like, oh, I want to record, like, mm. like something I wanted to do. So right. I seen him doing it. He rapping. He showing me stuff. And it got to the point where it's like, I feel like I could do this. Like, right. let me show you something. And then all I got was good feedback at first, at first, at first. So I'm like, all right, cool. How old were you at this point? 14. Okay. So, all the good feedback was cool. Then I dropped my first song with with Jason. And it did like 15,000 views. That okay. was my first song. So, after that. It's on that, YouTube now? It's on SoundCloud. SoundCloud? Run that up, man. Yeah. You have 15 called, now, we need 3,000. We need to yeah, run it up. That song, my first song called It's a Mystery. Uh, YK Bear, it's under... It's a mystery. It's a mystery. Okay, so... What's the one that they can go look up? You, because you on the B-Live circuit. You, you did a so B-Live B performance, right? B-Live performance. Uh, that song is called Freestyle Part 2. That's mm. that's my newest single. That's the song I I bring Ashton Silva out to for his last fight. I bring him out to a knockout. Bruh. Uh, that's what I was saying. Like, okay, so how does something like that work? How does that feel when you get to be on a platform that large and share not only like because you said that's your family, right? Yeah, that's my okay, cousin. Okay, so you out there with your you out there with your cousin. Y'all already, you know, grew up. You said y'all same age, right? Yeah. So how does it feel to see him doing what he wants to be doing, and then not only. Sharing that with you, but you're doing what you want to be doing and yeah. head it off to, and you're 17 years old, yeah. bro. So how does this feel for you? Man, it's crazy. Like, growing up, he always used to tell me, like, before I could even see it, but I kind of always, like, everything he said, he always, like, kept his word to, but he used to tell me, like, my first pro fight, I want to uh, I wanna fight at, at the convention center. Mm -hmm. Feel me? And his first pro fight couldn't be there because he wasn't 18 yet. You can't fight in the U.S. at the 18, or unless you're 18. So, okay. 
he had a couple fights and then he finally came back and he always told me when I started rapping like I don't need nobody big like you go be the person I bring out with me and he kept his word for that and it's crazy that's like, big salute and he knocked yeah. buddy out and he knocked buddy out Woo! <laughs> <laughs> So, hey man, give him his ass too, man. We're gonna wanna follow him too, man, because he's gonna be up and coming too. Follow my cousin Aston Silve, H two O. Uh he just signed to he just signed to Jake Paul. He got eight knockouts. He eight and oh. He's Jake Paul up. getting people paid too. You know, Jake Paul about getting the fighters paid. So yes, I think he in a good I think he in a good circuit. Alright, so let's talk about Gremlin, man. Um what 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 was the biggest thing that helped you determine the decision of going there? Like, man, was it the trip? What they do? They had some girls there. What what man, they do? Man, man, like before I even went out there, I was kind of already like. So, let me just say, before Gremlin, I had NAIA offers for football. Okay. And I kind of didn't really want to go that route, like. Like I just felt like it wasn't for me. Like I, I was gonna have to go to Kansas and. I me, I feel like it just wasn't for me. Mm -hmm. So I was trying to find something that was for me. And before, like, I had, had I had the day that I was going to Gremlin, and I knew a day I was going, and I was excited. Like, for me, I feel like this is going to be for me. Like, I was already knowing that this is going to be right, for me. Right, right. It felt so, right. Yeah, it felt right. So when I got out there, it was exactly what I thought it was going to be. Yeah. And then all the coaches show love, like, it was a good environment, yeah. teammates, everything yeah. was good. Uh, Shout out Gremlin, yeah, man. For sure. He builds, man. It's, it's really good to see young men deciding to go to HBCU because it comes with an experience that I think a lot of us should have, you know. Mm -hmm. uh, you getting away from the norm and being from Long Beach and being right by the beach and you know, living a certain lifestyle and seeing certain things. Now you're going to be in a whole different, which is going to open your eyes and make you see exactly how big the world is. Yeah. And it'll make your vision way larger as well, man. And you being somebody that's, uh, to me, likable, you know, you got a good look, mm -hmm. you, you're playing football, you do music. So I know you're going to be a successful uh, a brother. And I'm glad I can sure. have you on the hot seat. Early, <laughs> so when I tap in and be like, I need some tickets. I ain't gonna feel bad because I'm like, remember when I brought you on the podcast, yeah. man? You know what I mean? So you know, I really like to support people early. You know, I see, I see something great in you, man, and mm -hmm. just like everybody else does. So I, I just want you to, man, like, stay positive. That's you know, stay focused on the goal, and and realize how much of a blessing that it is because you know. Not everybody's in that circumstance. There's some people graduating high school right now. They don't know what they're going to do next. You know mm -hmm. what I mean? Yeah. They're going to be still at the crib. They might try to go to a JUCO or they might try to get a little part-time job. Whatever they're going to do is not going to be the experience that you're going to have. Man. For sure. You just got to cherish it and, and embrace every moment because when you get to that final moment, the most things that you're going to appreciate, the biggest thing you're going to appreciate is like that journey that you took to get there. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? So right now, embrace that. You know what I mean? For sure. I really salute you though, brother. So uh, we got the Be Live performances on YouTube, right? It's on YouTube, yeah. Okay. The latest single, what's the name of it again? Freestyle Part 2. Freestyle Part 2 on SoundCloud. SoundCloud. Right? Uh, all platforms? All platforms. No, okay. Freestyle Part 2 is on YouTube and SoundCloud. It's SoundCloud. not on... It's not on all platforms. I couldn't get the... You couldn't uh, get clear? I couldn't well, what about the other music? Everything else is on SoundCloud? Everything else is on... Everything. Everything else is on everything. Look him up. This is YK underscore Bear. Yes. Man, put some respect on his name. Number yes, 29, going to Grammar. What position you play? I play DB, corner, DB. safety. So guess what? You ain't getting no touchdowns on this dude right here. You I got know. that? And I'm getting one of these crew necks. So stop hating. Get mm -hmm. you one too. Salute. It's the That's Hot true. Seat Podcast. I'm calling this the Black Excellent Spotlight. For sure. With YK Bear. YK My Bear. man. Love, brother. Ah. I appreciate you, G. Yes, sir.